Hitting the robots gives you an Olive Garden coupon. Wow, it does give you an Olive Garden coupon. Huh, back for more, Sonic? Guess you never learned your lesson. I I'm a Mario. Today, I'm gonna be playing Sonic Generations with a borderline psychotic twist. Because what else is new here? This is, this is just my life, I guess. I talk to my therapist a lot about what I do for a living, and most of the time, he just kind of stares at me and nods because he doesn't really know how to respond to the things that I say. Um, and honestly, me too, man. I have to beat every single stage in the game as Mario from Mario 64. Yeah, we're, we're doing this. Mario from Mario 64 in Sonic Generations is one of the most technically impressive mods I've ever seen. And it wouldn't be possible without the talent and dedication of several insanely talented individuals. Back in 2021, a project was helmed to decompile Mario 64's code. A decompilation of a game is essentially just a, what the, what is this? What is this video? What, what, what the fuck? Wait, what? Why did that play? I didn't put that in there. What? What the hell? I think that was an ad for like a mobile game, but I, th there was no logo or anything. It was just that clip. Why does she get hit in the stomach with a soccer ball? Okay, um, I'm just gonna... We're, we're just gonna move on. A decompilation of a game is essentially the task of reverse engineering it down to its bare basics and fundamentals. It's kind of like turning a full meal of food back into its base ingredients. This gives people the advantage of knowing just how exactly a game works, how it ticks, but also allows them to then rip the source code from the game and effectively drop it into other projects. To make things even more accessible, a user named Jaburns actually went about cleaning up and repackaging the code from the decompilation, so then it became even easier for developers and modders to work with. It can be a real pain in the ass to pull this sort of thing off, but the results of that work are incredible. The possibilities of having the raw code to a game are seemingly limitless. If you thought the modding community for Mario 64 was already impressive as it is, now you can mod Mario 64 into other games and platforms. Mario 64 in Minecraft, Mario 64 in Blender. Mario 64 in fucking real life. I'll be honest, I can't believe that this is even possible. Fuck NFTs, man. They made Mario real. This Sonic Generations mod I'll be playing today by Scythe is actually built on the foundations of that decompiled code, allowing for a fully accurate and playable Mario from 64 to be inside of the game with one-to-one -one physics and correct moveset. Now, the thing that makes playing as him difficult in our situation is because I I don't think Sega designed these levels with Mario in mind. Shocking, I know. Mario is not nearly as fast or agile as Sonic is, so in order to beat the game, I'm gonna have to cheese the hell out of it. In order to make this sort of playthrough even remotely possible, Scythe added some extra features to give Mario a slight edge. Even with the small inclusions, however, I'm gonna have to fight the video game engine itself to even complete this one, breaking down how Sonic Generations is built in order to get myself from point A to point B. Recording for this was, uh... It was a lot. Turning off the YouTube voice for a second, I, I completely lost it like multiple times when I was playing this and it wasn't even for a joke. Like I completely lost my patience. <clears throat> so I mean like if you wanna, I don't know, subscribe to me or anything to make it up to me, that'd be really cool. Anyway, blah, 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 let's jam. Mario showed up. Hello. Nobody invited him. He showed up, he tossed both modern and classic Sonic into an incinerator and watch them die slowly. I'm about to blow your dick off. And if you don't have a dick, get a temporary one. This is Sonic Generations with Mario from Mario 64. The control scheme is exactly the same as it is in Mario 64. Now, thankfully, he does have one upgrade. You can put it on the wing cap. So here we go. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll, we'll get there eventually, guys. No worries. Oh. Okay, back to crawling. Excellent. Have you tried switching to Sonic? Uh, no. For obvious reasons. Oh, fucking tell me I just got myself stuck. 
Oh, fucking tell me. <laughs> Salt Man, if you hold RT or LT, you will switch into 3D mode and go around the loops. What? What the fuck? What? What the fuck? Hold up. So hold down RT or LT and then walk forward. Wow. Whew. So far, so good. Actually, wait, that's kind of cringe. Let me try again. I fucking love bacon, egg, and cheese. <laughs> oh, excellent. <laughs> Might have to go underwater. Wait, he has underwater physics? What? <laughs> Whoa, this is crazy. It's, it's literally just Mario 64. They really put their whole mod dussy into this mod. I'm gonna need you to never say Madussi ever again. What? Madussi? You don't want me to say Madussi ever again. How am I gonna do this? Wall jump? Oh yeah, let me wall jump. Oh my god, do I actually- Oh. This is gonna suck. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. One. Fuck! Wall jumping is so much easier in the Nintendo DS remake of Mario 64. <laughs> this is the worst part of the playthrough so far. <laughs> oh my god. I fucking hate this. Oh my... Oh. <laughs> Mario's dead! Why is wall jumping so fucking hard in Mario 64? This is fucking impossible. God. God is inside all of us. God is inside all of us. Hey guys, did you know that video games can be hard sometimes? Three. Four. I'm gonna cheat now. I killed myself on accident. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Oh my god, oh my god, Mario, get back! Okay. Thank god. I did it. Oh my god. We have now just discovered a new problem. Oh, there we go. Oh, holy shit. Can this level be over so I can change the song now? <laughs> Mario, please. We're actually advancing. Holy shit. Oh, no, please go up. No, go up. Go up. Why are you not going up? What the fuck is going on? Oh, great. Now I'm gonna die. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, this is actually awesome. Uh oh, no, 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 okay. Oh my god. Oh, thank god. Oh, oh my god. I spent a bit too much of my life wall kicking in that segment. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, no, we don't. No, please, please. I, for some reason, on the way up. Okay, well, I couldn't do it. Oh my god, I don't have enough time. You can alternatively fly over the spikes in the beginning and land on the platform above. What the fuck? I could have done that the whole time? Okay, well, now I'm up here. Oh. Oh, I missed it. Where am I? Oh no, everything's falling! I couldn't even get up there. Oh, oh, oh. No! No! Yes! Okay, I died, but like... Okay. Get rid of- get rid of the cap! Uh, I'm not gonna land on anything. Okay. Oh, no, come on! 
Bro, I don't even... No, no, no. What? You! Yes! I'm standing on nothing, but I still won. Here we go! I don't know, I like Rocket Lamp. Rocket Lamp's cool. Oh my god. <laughs> Can I just walk up without triggering it? Nope, nope. <laughs> maybe... can I lock myself in? No, I can't. Yeah, maybe I can avoid the trigger altogether. Maybe I, if I land here, maybe it won't fall. Is what I would say if the invisible wall did not hit me. Unless I do this. No, I... Mario 64 in Sonic Generation Sky Sanctuary Act 2 Alternate Way. Yes, you still need the wing cap. What the fuck? This exploit, yes, not a glitch, is possible because... The height you get from the wing cap is calculated by how fast Mario is moving. That means that basically, if you wouldn't lose speed somehow while flying, you would get unlimited height. What the fuck? What? Holy shit! Thank you, extremely specific YouTube video with 75 total views. We're gonna triple jump. Go down. Oh. Did I do- did I make it? Yes, I did! We have to get back on the rail. I think I need to get back on the- the top rail. Oh, okay, and I died. How do I make it go up fast? Oh, fuck. No, no, no! Salty, what's your best impression of Mario's falling to death scream? Wow! Mamma mia! Oh, shit! <laughs> okay, okay, here we go. Triple jump. Fly into the guardrail. Fly up. D die. Okay. Try again. Die. Dive. Oh my god. Okay. Go, Mario. Go. Doing good. Doing good. Is this, f is this physical? <gasps> I didn't face through. Let's fucking go. Oh my god. Oh. Imagine I just like died right there. I am so good at video games. All right. Mario time. <laughs> kick this butt. Literally, you have to kick his ass. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Mario's somersaulting. <laughs> God, Mario is so big next to Metal Sonic. This seems a pretty hard. See you later. I'm genuinely curious as to if this is possible. <laughs> okay, so I don't think any of the rival fights are going to be possible, sadly. There is a way. There's a video of No fucking way. Is there a video? Can you send it to me on Twitter right now? I will watch it right now. This video is four minutes long. I need to see this. What the absolute fuck? <laughs> what? The strategy here is to just skip the platform falling by jumping high enough, then go backwards and pray you can hit Metal Sonic coming towards you? What? How does he hit him now? That's the question. How the fuck did you do that? Okay, so the way that this level works is that the fight against Metal Sonic is an infinitely looping raceway, so it goes around in a circle, right? The falling platforms behind you are just an illusion. They respawn when you run back around in the circle. If you can jump over the death plane high enough and hit the invisible versions of the platforms behind the falling platforms, then you can land on them and just loop around the entire level and then kill Metal Sonic. If that sounds insane, yes. It is. How the fuck did anybody figure this out? 
Whoa, this Metal Sonic guy really freaking me out. I gotta get out of here. I failed. I gotta figure this out. I did it! Okay, we're, we're here. We're like to the left of the camera. You can kind of tell because there's a little bit of dust particles when we uh, run. Yeah, you see those? A little bit of dust particles showing up on the left? That's us. Oh, wait a sec. Do you guys see how the camera is slowly moving right now? See how it's slowly moving to the left? You want to know why? It's tracking Metal Sonic. Metal Sonic is on the other side, like all the way over there, like off in the distance. He he's on his way. He's on his way over. Yeah, see, there I am. Hey, Mario. Hey, bros. Just hanging out, you know. Okay, so Metal Sonic. Oh, you can see him. Look, he's off in the distance. You can see him. He's coming. He's probably like, where did you go? What the fuck? Hey, bud. <laughs> Look at him. He's cute. Hey, Metal. <laughs> yeah, we were... We uh, did some stuff. <laughs> I guess we're just going to walk with him. An evening walk. Oh, shit. Oh, I kicked- I kicked him! I kicked him! Dude, I, th I thought we were going out for a friendly walk, what the fuck? Why did my camera change? Why did the camera angle change? The camera angle changed and he yeeted the fuck out. I'm just waiting, like, why does the camera look like this? Legit, th this looks like an anime ending. Like, you know, like an anime ending sequence, and like Mario's running, is like, Dorotakai! Da-da! Mario, he is running fast! He's gonna save the day! He's gonna suck some ass! Okay, I'm gonna do a piss speed run. I'm gonna see if I can pee really fast while I wait on this. Piss speed run, go! Alright, I'm back. Is Metal Sonic still not here? <laughs> yeah, I think he- is he in the tunnel? Oh wait, is that him? Yeah, I think that's him! I'm shocked that this is like actually possible. Okay, so here's here's my guesstimation, right? At certain points throughout the level, I think he has specific triggers for specific attacks. That's why he attacked me earlier. Maybe there's a trigger coming up where it, he'll he'll be forced to attack no matter what, even if I'm not there. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, I, I've kicked him onto the ground. Whoa, cinematic sweep. Oh, they're gone now. Oh, shit, metal. Yeah, did it! I did it! There we go! Okay, look both ways before crossing the street. Alright, it's safe. Oh my god! <laughs> hey, I, I don't like the police! Mario, why do you hate the police? Because I'm Italian! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Wait, wait, I think I got it. Boom. There we go. And that's how we do it. <laughs> what are you doing there, Mario? <laughs> oh, wait, sorry, I gotta open up this door. All right. <laughs> hey guys, what is your most anticipated sequel of all time? Mine is Racist Mario 2. You guys ever seen Racist Mario? Fucking classic, am I right? Go, Mario, go. Go, Mario, go. You'll never catch me alive, coppers. I'm Mario. <laughs> <laughs> Wahoo, man! Look, I'm breaking at the sound barrier! Fuck! Uh. <laughs> ah, shit, where is my car? What the- what the fuck? What the- what is the ramp? What the fuck? Oh, holy shit! I'm in the middle of the road! I hope I don't get hit by a car, that- that would suck. Please don't hit me, I am but an Italian- <laughs> and I'm Italian! Pizza! I- I'm Mario. Speed Highway was actually really easy. However, I did try to beat Metal Sonic for like 20 minutes beforehand, so I think a D is more appropriate. I just realized this, how am I gonna do the truck chase? Alright. Flying around the invisible wall. And there we go. And now we are in the truck chase. I'm being mauled. I don't need- the truck is just gone. A lot of things are happening right now. This is just what San Francisco looks like. I love City Escape. I wish trucks were real. 
How many edibles do you have to take to start imagining vehicles uh, existing? <laughs> Great. Oh shit! I got a parking ticket. Not anymore, bitch. People say I'm not, I'm not as fast as Sonic, but I still go pretty fast. Your Mario voice sounds like King Julian from Madagascar. Oh, Mort. Let me tell you, Mort. Shit, do be crazy, Mort. Ah, oh, King Julian! You make me so horny, baby. <laughs> King Julian! What is it, Mort? I want to suck on your toes. No, Mort. It's fucking weird. Check out this sweet light dash. All right. Okay. There we go, some nice classic Mario platforming. What the fuck? Why does this keep happening to me? Here's the truck chase. Watch as I die. Hold on, I don't... I don't think that this is supposed to happen. <laughs> you guys see the truck? All right, here we go. Okay, so the truck is ahead of me. Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm stuck in the hitbox. I can maybe I can fly above the hitbox. Nope. This is fucking wacky. Whoa, 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 Fuck! Oh no! Please, 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 don't lock me out! Oh my! I I lost my keys underneath my truck. I can't find them. No, oh, no, I'm dead. Uh, let me get this straight, Mort. You think killing those guys is funny? Comedy is subjective. Isn't that what they all say, King Julian? So that's it, are you crazy? That's your defense for killing three men, Mort? Because they're mean to you? No, they couldn't carry a tune to save their lives. How about another joke, King Julian? I think we've had enough of your jokes, Mort. What do you get when you cross a mentally ill loner with a system that abandons him and treats him like trash? I tell you what you get. You get what you fucking deserve. Mort canonically has a kill count. It's on the wiki. Salty, you should read Mort's wiki page. I'll do it in a second. Let me, let me do the... I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come. He loves King Julian's feet. An obsession which started when he saw King Julian use them to kick some Fusa in the first episode. Oh, this is awesome. I'm not gonna listen to the feet song, chat. Ah, I'm off the shit, King Julian! Mm. Oh, yes, King Julian! Ah. Salty, this is unironically my first stream. Dude, I'm sorry, man. It's not my fault that you think that feet are gross. I think that feet are very ele- You know what? No, I'm not even gonna do this bit. This is not a good bit. There we go. All right, we're gonna fly. And just keep flying like this. We haven't gotten over the invisible wall yet. Wow, that truck jumped. Whoa, what is the truck doing? What the truck doing? I think it's safe to go down now. Oh. Wow, this is the slowest fucking, whoa! I'm supposed to be in an automated section, and I'm just not. Ah, uh, up! Oh, avert your eyes! Oh, hi, truck. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Tell me this is fucked. Alright. Guess who's about to beat Matt Turk? It's me. Or should I say, it's a me. Here he comes! Here it is. It's the run. Oh, please don't kill me. Of all times, why now? Of all times! Oh, thank God. Thank God, auto run segment. Yes! Yes! Get rings, get rings! Yes! Yes! 
Oh, no, no, no. I did everything correctly. Let me tell you something, Batman. Have you ever played Mario Mod Sonic Generations? There's always hope in a hopeless place, Joker. No, there's really not. There's no escaping the truck. The truck is everywhere, Batman. The truck will follow you, and it will keep following you to the end of time. It will hit you when you least expect it, Batman. Are you kidding me? I went through my Joker arc for nothing! I have been successfully unjokered. Now go for an S rank. Shut the fuck up! We don't talk about the truck segment. Did I just get stuck in a fucking loop? I literally, I can't move. <sighs> Finally, I can actually play the game. Oh, never mind. I, I ditched the go-kart. The go-kart left without me. The go-kart left without me. Oh my god. Mario was not built to go this way. Oh my god. Thank Christ. Oh no. You bitch. I don't want to start over. <sighs> we have to do it. You know what they say, Batman. Once the truck is gone, everything becomes the truck. This truly is the Elden Soulsborn Shadows Die Twice uh, of the Mario games. Oh my god, yes. Thank you. Not as bad as you might think, but I don't want to do it again. Look how small he is. Huh, back for more, Sonic? Guess you never learn your lesson. I, I'm a Mario. I doubt that this is possible. I'm not gonna lie. Can I just swim into chaos? Am I not? Oh. Guys, I think that this is actually possible. <laughs> All right, chaos. Feel the wrath of Mario. There we go. <laughs> the, the Doppler effect of like Mario. How did that work? Here we go. Here we go indeed. There's a spider in the corner of my room right now, right above my streaming setup, and it's going to bug me all stream, because if I lose track of it, I will never be able to sleep ever again. I love how Mario looks photoshopped in. He does kind of look photoshopped in in this environment, specifically. Let's, let's team up, make a meme. What is a show from your childhood that you like? What about, like, Code Lyoko? Like, I know that people reference the foreheads of Code Lyoko characters sometimes, but, like, it's not really a meme format to just reference it, you know? Let's make a meme format right now. Um, let's see, what's a funny... Okay, this is a pretty funny screen cap. Hashtag Roger moment. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, that's a hashtag Roger moment for sure. First meme. Be nice. Okay, well, that's unnecessary. Oh, we should make a meme of Dobby at some point. Is there, like, a Dobby VTuber model? Can I just, like, do an entire stream as Dobby? Dobby is live. Dobby is real. <laughs> uh, <laughs> there it is. Methinks Harry Potter might join stream. Dobby noticed that someone in chat said that that they will kill Dobby. Dobby's got this. Dobby's got this. Dobby did not have it. Dobby, you're going to lose subscriber for swearing. 
Dobby does not care. Dobby is a free elf. Dobby speed run. Check it. Dobby wishes we could go back to the time when JK Rowling wasn't transphobic but was just fucking weird on Twitter. Remember all the shit that she made canon? Like how all of the wizards defecated themselves and just magic the doo doo away. That was fucking weird. Dobby allowed to swear. Dobby's a free elf. Sick of all this bullshit Dobby is. You're sick of Dobby. Dobby's sick of you. Dobby's sick of this bullshit. Kangaroo Key says, Yo, Dobby. This stream goes hard, dude. Dobby can't fuck this up. Oh, fuck. It's not over yet. Oh, Dobby got it. Yes. Let's go, Dobby. Derek, this bit has gone on too long. Who is Derek? This is Dobby's stream. Dobby spots a red ring. Oh, excellent. Oh, Do Dobby's almost there. Dobby did it. Thank you for congratulating Dobby. Want to give a quick shout out to M Master Potter for giving Dobby the sock cock. Cock sock. Thank you all for being there for Dobby. Anyway, I'm done with this bit. <laughs> <laughs> that was probably one of my longer bits. Sorry guys, Dobby fell down a flight of stairs. He won't be coming back anytime soon. This is my first salty stream and the first thing I saw was fucking... First thing I saw was fucking Dobby the VTuber. <laughs> no, I th Bro, what the f <laughs> Butterfingers. Am I right, guys? Yeah, man. Haha, <laughs> good joke. Butterfingers, lol. <laughs> Fuck you, guys. Okay, there we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 no. What the fuck? <laughs> Would you mind if I just... Uh, yeah, just go through. Sorry about your window. Woo! Avoiding barrels. I fought the monkey who did this once. Incredible Chris Pratt impression. Thank you. Guys, what if instead of Donkey Kong, it was Donkey Cock? Like, what if? Oh, shit. That was on me. Okay, I just gotta aim for the balloons. I don't think I can aim for the balloons. Oh, shit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. That kills me. That just kills me. Okay, here it is, here it is. There we go. Oh, it doesn't even bring me- oh, shit. Is this enough altitude to get to that bumper? Carefully? Are you kidding me? It's right there! Come on! Uh... Wait, hold on. Oh my god. Do better. Thank you. Thank you for the tip, guys. You guys are killing it tonight. Oh my god, it's happening again. Wait, cling! Cling to the wall! Uh, Cybershell did it legit. I clipped it and sent it to you on Twitter. Okay, I'm gonna look. Oh. Come on, Mario. Fucking lucky motherfucker. Are you kidding me? That's what you have to do? How the fuck did Cyber do this? Wait, hold up. Yes! Is this gonna murder me? This is gonna murder me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, thank you. Oh, here we go. A mock speed segment. At normal running speed. What the fuck, the camera? I can't see the incoming lasers. Please do not mess up again. I'm trying so hard. No! I died. What the fuck, man? 
There we go. Glitched it out. I can't wait for there to be an invisible wall. This is the worst. What the fuck? I'm gonna go pee. I'm angry. Man. Man, I want to kill myself. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hitting the robots gives you an Olive Garden coupon. Wow, it does give you an Olive Garden coupon. What the fuck? And there it is. Okay, got all of them. God, this is a long walk. Just goes to show how fast Sonic can go. Switch to Scout. He's the fast one. Okay, you know, yeah, you know what? I'll switch to Scout. You, you, you see, guys? I, I switched to Scout, guys. I'll put it in my trophy room. No, sorry, not denied. Whoosh, ping, what? <laughs> All right, how does this thing work? Excellent. Wow, it's like I'm playing the game. But I'll just go back up like this. Look how much I've improved. Ignore that. Okay, go, 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 go. Go, go. Oh my god! Oh, okay, no more light dash. And hit the ramp. Uh oh, uh oh, I'm gonna trigger the glitch. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No, go down. There's gonna be invisible walls, Mario. Mario, please! Oh no. Okay. Bye, Mario. Editor, put up a picture of Big Chungus. No reason, I just- I just want it up there. Make the picture of Big Chungus, uh, orange? And I'll put the text orange Big Chungus underneath it. So many people just unsubbed. Take it away. You're a psychopath. You're talking to an imaginary editor. No, I'm not. Editor, say hi. Hi. Please. Please. Please say hi. I, I said need to prove that I'm not just imagining this. I said hi. Please. Please. Hi. Please. Hi. Also, the Big Chungus idea was bad. Just put, I don't know, two Dobbies. Okay, now make the two Dobbies dance. Thank you. Editor, new bit. Um, change the color of the screen to red. Uh, and now make the walls ooze green slime. <laughs> put your favorite frame of Avatar The Last Airbender on screen. Let's take it off screen and put it back on. Take it off. On, off. On. Off. Thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Listen, listen, I'm sorry. Sorry, making your job harder. <laughs> Listen, if there's any way I can make it up to you, maybe like a high five or something. Sure, let's high five. Yeah, high five. <laughs> Guys, it's obvious I don't pay my editors. I only pay them in exposure. Exposure, handshakes, and meth. You know, you know who has the biggest taste for meth? Fucking Lark. Okay, whoever's editing this, if it's not Lark, contact Lark, get a picture of him, uh, and Photoshop him with meth. God damn it, I fucked up again. I'm so angry. Photoshop him with two bags of meth. Get us? <laughs> I don't even think that Lark is gonna be very into this. Keep up the good work, whoever's editing this. You're doing a great job. Thank you. We did it. Finally. Yes. It's over. <laughs> Never ask me to do anything ever again. That was a good victory. Editor, take a picture of me. Photoshop me with two bags of meth. I'm feeling good. And that's it, guys. We don't we don't need to do anything else. Not nothing else, guys. It's not it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work, guys. To even hit the boss, you have to speed up to hit him. You literally need the homing attack to hit him. I- I can't hit him! Oh yeah, wait, the spider on the ceiling, it's gone. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to sleep tonight. Oh.
Oh, fuck, it's in my face!